A nearby star is emitting weird radio waves. A star close to our solar system was found last week to be playing some pretty weird jams on the radio. Well, not exactly. The Arecibo Observatory in Puerto Rico discovered peculiar radio signals coming from the star Ross 128 in the Virgo constellation. Scientists say the reason for this could be one of three things. The signals could have originated from a solar flare, from something else passing in front of the telescope's view of Ross 128, or it could simply be a radio burst from a high orbit satellite. Researchers say the recurring hypothesis that aliens are behind the signal is at the bottom of many other explanations. So it's probably not ET or the Death Star, Spock or the Saiyans. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Don't touch that dial, Tomo Sapiens. We got much, much more alien and alien-like content coming at ya. Ancient worm monster found in the Philippines. Scientists have known about the giant shipworm for centuries, but none have seen a living, breathing specimen until now. Giant shipworms aren't actually worms, but bivalves, like clams and mussels. They live in three-foot-long tubular shells, planted in muddy, shallow bays. This unicorn of the mollusk world was recently discovered hanging out in the southern part of the Philippines. A local TV segment about the creatures tipped off a team from Northeastern University. They went to a lagoon in Mindanao's Sultan Kundara province and managed to collect five live worms. Back in the lab, researchers cut off one end of the shell and took out the slimy, black, baseball-sized mass of flesh. Unlike the common shipworm, which feeds on rotting wood, its giant cousin has bacteria in its gills that churn out nutrients from carbon dioxide. It still has digestive organs despite its unique mode of survival, but they're tiny from lack of use. It's not clear how many of the weird-looking creatures are left in the wild, so the team is keeping the exact location of the shipworm home a secret. Locals, though, have been harvesting the giant worms for years, eating it as an aphrodisiac, medicine, and just a tasty side dish. This jumbo-sized planet Earth may support alien life. American scientists have discovered a supersized Earth-like planet in a nearby star system that could support alien life. Exoplanet LHS 1140b orbits a red dwarf star every 25 days at a proximity 10 times closer than Earth to the Sun. This red dwarf star is much dimmer and cooler than our Sun, meaning the star's habitable zone is closer. However, its cosmic radiation could still damage the planet. LHS 1140b is 1.4 times the size of planet Earth, but is almost seven times heavier indicating that it's likely composed of rock and an iron core. It's because of this density that researchers believe the planet may be robust enough to endure the radiation and still hold water. Scientists will be able to examine the 5 billion year old exoplanet much further after NASA launches the James Webb Telescope in 2018. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. NASA reckons the moons of Jupiter and Saturn may support life. New research from NASA suggests that the vast oceans found on moons orbiting Saturn and Jupiter could support microorganic life. On Enceladus, Saturn's sixth largest moon, the Cassini spacecraft found evidence of hydrogen gas during a deep dive through a water plume in October of 2016. Hydrogen and other chemical elements along with water and energy are key for supporting life. Scientists suspect this points to the possibility of microbial life existing on Enceladus. Separate but similar research concerning water plume eruptions from Europa, the fourth largest of Jupiter's moons, may also point to life there. The Hubble Space Telescope observed eruptions from a warm area on Europa twice in a two-year period, each higher than the last. NASA will investigate this thermal activity further in the 2020s, when the Europa Clipper spacecraft is launched. 